In today's restaurant report card, we're talking about places that had issues with gizzards and dead bugs. We're also highlighting all the restaurants that scored a 100. We're going to start in the capital city where Nick's Gyros and Subs 3 on Two Notch Road scored an 80, our lowest grade this week. The inspector found black and brown buildup on the inside of the ice machine. The restaurant was also cited for holding 30 pounds of chicken gizzards at 76 degrees. DHEC says cold foods must be kept at or below 41 degrees. Another issue, ready to eat food items were not being date marked. Over in Lexington County, Chin's Chinese restaurant on Columbia Road scored an 83. According to the report, an employee used a knife to cut raw chicken and then stored it as clean without washing it with soap or sanitizing it. Also, the inspector found broccoli in boxes that were used to store raw chicken. Another violation, the restaurant could not determine when to throw food out because food was not being date marked. Down in Orangeburg County, Great China Buffet on John C. Calhoun Drive scored an 83. According to the report, the inspector found dead bugs and grime on the nozzles of the fountain drink machine. This restaurant was also cited for not date marking foods, which is a violation they were hit with during their last inspection. Now on to the Hall of Fame, where we highlight the restaurants that scored a 100. Peacewise Coffee Company in Casey, Taste of Europe in Columbia, The Nut House and Country Market in Ridge Spring, Shuckers of Sumter in Sumter, Fish and Wings in Columbia, Wasabi in Orangeburg, Brenda's Special Affairs in Orangeburg, Grady's Billiards in Lexington, Diggity Dogs in Columbia, DeLuca's in West Columbia, DNT Roadside Kitchen in West Columbia, and Casey's Barbecue Bark Mobile in West Columbia. All these spots dished up perfect scores. For a full list of the restaurants that scored below a 90, head on over to WLTX.com. For Restaurant Report Card, I'm Whitney Sullivan.